Okay, this is our lobby area. These are the bins for all of our dogs that are either here now or are going to be coming in over this Memorial Day weekend. We've got their names on the bins. We take their collars and leashes off, put them in there for safekeeping. Then they can play outside without having to worry about um, any problems with pulling on the collars or, or leashes. Okay. This is our office area. We've got a little doggy in there as usual. There's always a dog in here for one reason or another. The rest of them stay outside. This is a collage of some of our dogs that have been here over the last couple of years. More bins. Over here is our grooming room. We do full service grooming. Groomer has 29 years of experience. She's great with the dogs. They love her and she's great at grooming. There's a picture of her right here. That's Brooke. Okay, these kennels in here are used for our large dogs or a couple of medium dogs from the same family. We use these for display purposes in this room till we need them, which we always do at the holidays. Those are the mats that we provide, sheepskin mats, that people can bring their own items that make the dog feel comfortable, put them in there as well. Okay, so we've got a few of those in here. And then we have about 20 more of them in another building. Okay. Now I'm going to go back here and show you where the little dogs stay. So we're walking back through the lobby. And into the little dog room. So these are the types of kennels the little dogs stay in. And the dogs that play together during the day get to stay in the same room at night so they all know each other. So they're very comfortable and they, they fall asleep within about 20 minutes of coming in here because they're so tired from playing outside all day. As you can see, some people bring their own items to put in the kennels. Others do not. We have pictures of the dogs on their kennel cards. See if I can get a close up of this. So we know where each doggy goes for the night. So they're only in their kennels for eating twice a day and for nighttime. The rest of the time they're out playing with other dogs. They have same size, temperament, and they're fully supervised. These are just some pictures up here of the different groups of dogs. I'll just pan around here to give you more of a view. And then we'll go out to the side yard. Okay, in the morning when we come in, the first thing we do is let the little dogs out of the room here and they can use the restroom out here on the side yard while we're fixing breakfast. So they have this area stay in for about 20 minutes while breakfast is being prepared and then I'll show you our kitchen area this is the kitchen okay. these are more kennels for the little dogs overflow area And larger kennels here. These kennels here we usually use for the senior dogs because they could either go on the big dog side when they play during the day or the little dog side depending on their temperament and what they like. So they're kind of in the middle here so they could go out either way to the left or right little dog area, big dog area. I'm going to take you through the kitchen here, kitchen laundry area. We provide the food, but some people bring their own food. Okay. Okay, over 
over here we have more kennels. This is our Nutrisource dog food. It's very high quality food that we feed our boarding dogs here. It has no uh, chemicals, of course, no byproducts. Everything's organic, no grains. A lot of kennels for the real small dogs. Okay, and then the area over here for the big dogs. All of these kennels, the same type, the large kennels with the glass fronts. And we have the kennel cards on those as well. So the big dogs are let out first thing in the morning directly to the play area where they're supervised while we're fixing breakfast. So we'll go out the side yard where they go to the play area through this door. Okay. And side area over here. All grass, gravel, no dirt here. Our dogs are out playing now. Hi, baby. And they go right out through this gate. They have the whole yard to play in all day, up on the hill, they have pools. And you can go to our videos of dogs playing to see the whole yard. I'm just trying to show you what our facility looks like overall. Okay, I'm gonna go back and over to the little dog side. There's Bernie, lazing like usual. Hi, Bernie, honey. Okay, let's go back through the building here and over to the little dog side where the little dogs are playing. We've got heating and air conditioning and uh, that goes on an hour before the dogs come to bed. Heating or air, whichever's needed. It goes off an hour after they're out playing. Okay, I'm gonna go through here now. This is another kitchen area which is needed during the holidays. More washing machines, dryers. Little dogs are on the left side here. They can go inside, outside, the same things. The big dogs are on the right side and they can go in and out as they please. It's all, cool. it's all cool in here. It's all cool. And heated. Little dogs. This is our little dog introduction area. Every time a little dog comes in, we put him in here first. So the little dogs that are already here can introduce themselves. So doggy clubhouse over there, it's cool. We have couches, chairs, everything in there for them. Stairs up to the upper level there where they can go. Little swimming pool. This is a big dog introduction area right here where they a new dog can sniff the dogs on the other side and vice versa and get to know each other before the new dogs released to the pack. Our handlers are up on the hill right now doing some watering. We're constantly hosing down, deodorizing, disinfecting. So it's the cleanest place you're going to find in at least Utah, if not nationwide. <laughs> So again, I invite you to look at the videos of the dogs playing so that you can see closer up, you know, what goes on when the dogs are here during the day. And come by and visit us. We'd love to take you on a tour, Mondays through Saturdays from 10 to 3. 
and check out our website which you already have or you wouldn't be watching this video right now but it'll give you the hours of our business hours our policies pricing anything you can't find there give us a call we'll be happy to help you okay thank you